There's going to be some big changes in Fairfield. We're going to have like a burnout pad. Um, there's going to be parties in this festival. Free parties every every weekend right here in the uh, showgrounds. Um, yeah, it's going to be mad. We're going to have like just graffiti everything. Every house will be graffiti under my mesh. So we are spoken word artists, so we perform slam poetry on stage and we try to give a message to what we say and we try to get a reaction from the audience. We all look forward to um, all the, the other artists actually, the other artists and there's a few rides and stuff going on so it looks cool. Yeah. What do I enjoy about being on? I enjoy that a whole bunch of diverse people and just everyone comes to bring it on. They line up early and get in, have lots of fun really. I dance here. I danced in the like the other um, stage, and I've seen a bunch of people singing, and they're really good artists, by the way. And yeah, I've just been around, walking around, and seeing all the stalls that they are. What do you think about bringing on festival so far? No, it's fun. Yeah. What have you been looking forward to the most? The music. God. Any certain act in particular? Glad. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Did you like his performance? Yeah, I did. Yeah, I actually participated in a lot of things. We done. Um, the basketball, we've done some football stuff, we've done this safe uh, relationship thing um, and yeah, it's been, it's been pretty good. It's fantastic, I think it's great, it's great for the, um, the youth to get together and support their, um, their idol, their band. How are you feeling today? I am so excited, In stereo is going to be here. I know, are they your favourite acts today? You do not understand how much I love them. Yeah? yeah. What else are you looking forward to? I'm looking forward to the basketball comp going on, as well as the workshops we've got going on. I'm just so excited. Um, we are called Guntwang Aboriginal Resources Incorporated. We're a not-for-profit organisation. Uh, we have two lots of workshops, one in at the Bonnerick Community Centre, which is for an Indigenous women. We have a second group in at Liverpool at the Ganagara Land Council that is for Indigenous and non-Indigenous men and women. What made you decide to come to the Bring It On Festival? Um, I mean, there's a lot of cool lineups, and I think like I, you know, a lot of cool, inspiring musicians. So I was like, yo, I want to be here too. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I loved it. Um, you know, it's a cool, cool place. If you haven't been, come next year because this place goes off.